Ladies and gentlemen, your 2016 Chicago Cubs. Three, two. High fly ball out of the deep left center. Way back. Gone. That is a two run homer for Jake Arietta. What can't he do? He has officially entered superhero status. Give that guy a movie deal. First and second, one out. Addison Russell, the batter. And Runner goes, the pickoff throw, and now the throw to second, and Baez is tagged out. Baez thought he got in there safely, and he's motioning to the Cubs' third base dugout, and we're all going to wait for the video people to take a look, and I think he might have been in there safely. Watch the swim move. He misses him there. He misses wow. him there. He misses him there. He's and right. he's trying to figure out how they could call him out. As this one is overturned, Baez is safe at second. Big chop left side, gloved by Bryant, cutting in front of Russell, throws to Rizzo to end the inning. Score at 5-3, to three. Red still without a hit. We go to inning number five. Swing and a miss. The 0-1. Fowler coming on. Two down. Kozak lines out. Demuth could easily have rung him up there. Here comes the 2 2. In the air, this should do it. Jason Hayward makes a catch. It's a no hitter. Jake Arietta has done it again. That was fun. His second no hitter. In his last 11 regular season starts, I'd say the sky's the limit. Maybe the universe is the limit for this guy. Just be oh, ready. Feel <laughs> <laughs> good. Yeah, I'll take that. Okay, we'll make it quick. And he drives out in the left, number 100. Jubilant in the Cubs dugout. That will get into the left field corner. Hayward on his way to third. Trouble there for Duvall. Gary Jones is going to send him. And he will score. Throw to third. Late. Cubs lead 1-0. Bryant in the air. Deep center. It will. Two for two, two RBIs, and the Cubs lead again. It's a win round trip travel for two on Southwest Airlines. Oh, oh there baby! Go. Give me that read again, Andre. Give me a read. 4,972 feet. <laughs> that 
ball went to Kentucky. A three run homer for Bryant. It's seven to three. Here's the 0 1. Another ball hit hard out in the left center. He's going to try for two, and he's going to be safe. He got in. I love that. Chris Bryant doing tons of damage against Reds pitching. He has been remarkably consistent. Number three, full house time, baby. I don't want no stinking cycle. What a show. What a show. <laughs> Unofficially, not going to do it. Unofficially, according to Scott Lindholm, who does a lot of baseball research, since 1913, he is the first player ever to do this: three homers and two doubles. And Jason Heron trying to coast in the center. It's down. Cuts to grab the lead. Rizzo in. Zobrist scores. Contreras on his way to third. Save. Three to two. All these fans waited out a lengthy rain delay and they waited a long time. Face Kyle Hendricks, who is the starter for the Cubs tonight. Confidence even more. Chases down and away, and Hendricks strikes him out on three pitches. 2 2, swing and a miss. Awkward looking swing from McCutcheon, and Hendricks, a terrific start. Second. Swing and a miss at a changeup and a gun strikes out. Strike three called. And there is another strikeout. Got it. Strikeout number 12. I think Cup fans are excited about Wilson Contreras. I mean, he's probably having enough trouble just keeping his heart rate down, and then he gets a standing ovation from 40,000 people. That's a, a goosebump kind of moment here before his first ever big league at bat. High and deep to center field, and it is gone! Can you believe it? What a scene and what a moment for Wilson Contreras homering in his first major league at bat. Got a standing ovation before the at bat and a curtain call Travis after. Travis Wood is on the mound. And Pedro Strope is in left. The Cubs have used Wood, Patton, and Strope. Three relief pitchers in left field tonight. Mm -hmm. Chicago Cubs, Dexter Fowler. John Lester and Jake Arietta. Leading off and playing second base from the Chicago Cubs, Ben Zobrist. Heading third, playing third base from the Chicago Cubs, Chris Bryant. Then playing first base from the Chicago Cubs, Anthony Rizzo. Batting ninth, the shortstop from the Chicago Cubs, Addison Russell. Home run hitter in the National League, and this is belted. Out of here, Chris Bryant, first pitch swinging, 1 0 National League. This guy is putting together already. Here's the pitch. Has their spikes on. <laughs> I don't know if Wood's going to have a play on this one. It is caught. He races back to the Ivy and made the catch. <laughs> wow. 
<laughs> he tried to not smile there for a second. I thought I was I was looking down at Joe Madden and it looked like he was real stoic, like, ah, I knew that was going to happen. Finally, he breaks the smile. This is awesome. He gets a good jump on it, but this looked like it was either out or wow. off the ivy. This is not an easy play for anyone, even a regular left fielder, to make, knowing where he's at on the wow. field, up against the ivy, makes the catch. And that's a brick wall behind that ivy. Might leave a mark. And that's a pitcher. Look at the standing ovation he's getting, not just from his teammates, from everybody here. I don't know what else is in contention for Web Gems today, but we know what number one is. Opportunity at the plate. 2 2. He gets the bunt down. Runner coming home. Cubs win. With two strikes on him. Lester gets a bunt down to score the winning run here in the 12th. There's the 1 0 to Russell. Deep left center. Grand slam time. Qualifies as a loser. This day and age of specialization, fireballing relievers, shortening the game is what it's all about. The big lefty, Aroldis Chapman, making his Chicago Cubs debut. Average fastball velocity a little better than 100 miles per hour. 101. Cubs win. Cubs win. Chapman in his Cub debut goes one. We two. talked about earlier. Rodriguez on the ground to the left side, smothered by Bay as wow. he gets it with a fine play. That's a wild. That's why he's playing third base when John Lester pitches. Not only does he have a strong arm, but the accuracy off of his knees. Along the right field line. And Rizzo on the ledge. He's got it. Oh, what a play. <laughs> <laughs> well, the bobblehead company. We got the tarp catch. Now we got the ledge catch. Both against the Milwaukee Brewers. Give them the gold glove right now. Excuse me, sir. On the barrier, lanes in. Beautiful play. It sticks to landing. Big error. That could have been a double play ball. As Rizzo punches out into right center. Caesar scores. Ristella will score. Here comes Brian Cubs lead. Cubs lead five to four. Oh, baby, Anthony Rizzo. And this place is rocking and rolling. Polanco swings at the first pitch, and it's caught by Rizzo! Oh, oh, my goodness. Wow. He may have just saved three runs. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> Of doing more with Russ, finding some holes on three different occasions. Jason Hayward, the hero today. Because he has such a hard time controlling his emotions, you can tell he's trying so hard. 
Look what he just did. Look what he just did. Talking with both David Ross and John Lester. Great move by Joe Madden. Beautiful. David Ross gets a standing ovation. All of his teammates in the dugout give him a big bear hug. Ross visibly emotional. Ross makes a curtain call in full catcher's gear. Tradition. 